And Lion Strike Array actually struck, hits, hits some misery. Open Wounds is available too. Oh. There's no rage for Illidan, however, but there should be enough damage here. Is he going to go down? Yes, it will be. First Blood. Yeah, you, you, need, now. you need to have idle lineups. They didn't get scouted out, I believe, here on bottom lane. So uh, they're fine. moving back, and it's caught in the puck hole. He pops the heal already. Illidan wants to try and turn and fight this one, but now getting caught in the Riptide and Snare, and full damage deal, 105, 129, and that is going to be... An Illidan. He probably won't even, like... He won't worry about diving on this tower. Uh, probably just gonna go in and kill him now. Yep. Just on there. There it goes. Rage is up, so it doesn't matter about the Grave Chill. Double TP's on the way in, and they already throw down the wall trying to get some copies, and they get a copy of Pycat as well as Misery, and Pycat back back into it, and NS bringing in a Hellbear. Gonna look for a stop with the Impedance. He should have enough damage right there to kill a Pycat. Successful doing so, and Misery also on the run. One more attack, or just using the Iron Shell to burn him out. Arrow attempted bottom. Oh, it hits. That didn't even look like it hit. But it did. God is on target. ASI if he surges in and arrow flies. The Hellbear tanks it for the team. The Puck Holy catching up the two supports. Also goes Sans Nasa back. There is no well, Zerg back for the wall. In fact, he has to use Sol Ring to do it. He's too low on life to do so. And now with the Plants of Field attack from the low ground. Won't be able to get out of that one. So two for the prize of one puck did go down during that fight, and now Naga had to throw the only stop Illidan's TP. He's got Rage in one second, he's got Infest as well, jumps in and out of the creeps. Now on the Rage out of here, no TP options, face boost in one second time. He might be able to armor... Nice arrow, wonderful arrow from God. And Starfall yeah. already gets the kill on our side. Misery in snap, he gets on that S. This heal's gonna wear off in just a moment. They already hit the arrow and the star fall can hit on crazy as well as Arzad who came in. Arzad full a little bit of space with that light strike array. And now also a little bit more damage on 1437. Illidan raging up the dark sea wall. It's trying to help out Pycat, which will be successful because Moonlight Shadow are on the high side that and there's a big rip type at the men the mech charge already up on KSI using those iron shield damage. And look how many copies they've got. This dark sea wall is fighting so hard for VP. But LG International have still brought down three. They might might lose Pycat right now, but they will do so. Dark's here able to get that kill with the Iron Shell. Then over to Brax, phase shift. He doesn't use it, just this one last silence. Two and nice then over kills. to Misery, and I think it's going to be more than two, man. Misery's on the run. It should be. Phase boots come up cool down. The surge is already worn off, and the arrow tried to hit there on Illidan, but nice stomp. Both down in snare as well, keeping in range of the tower. God does not have any extra mana, but he may have enough damage. Illidan, he has to rage. The tower damage will still kill him off. And Naga Ulti allows Misery to escape from that one. Wonderful play there by LGD International. It's, it's like this farm isn't really <laughs> finding its way in. And really jumping in, but it's a Puck Ulti. Going on NS, Illidan was still able to rage, and now Infest jumps straight back out of that in snare at the end of it. And NS gets himself away, flies the field, kills him on the return in. And now start being followed up by God. Arrow will fly. Crazy, almost walking into that. But then Illidan says, well, Arrow's gone. Let's go fight people. It's Pie Cat, Rage. Got to get in closer. Those familiar birds. They won't be able to stun, but they do some damage. Illidan, going to go on Misery. He's oh, already misery. raged up Misery through the ulti off. And now he does go. Pycat starts stealing that damage from Illidan, he's going to have to break it out. And then in comes Brax, wonderful double silence from him. And that's going to control a little bit more until Crazy holds him up. Light strike array from RSR, catching out too. Brax in a phase shift. He cannot avoid the DK, however. And Pycat being Lacuna bladed up. And Impetus, everything they can to bring down the Razor. They are throwing even the Slave to get that last little hit in. And God, he can't leap, but he can turn around and start fall. Point blank rage arrow. NS, so low on life. God takes a double kill, leaves himself away. He won't go down to earn. I yes. hope he does it. He will. He does die. He could have denied himself a creep, but he hoped that he would live. Yeah. But again, we have this five on five to combat. I got a feeling that's going to be the trend of this game until that tier one tower finally goes it's down. Big right. oh. Illidan, he's in very, very close here. And then Blink in Sun Street Call. Called out to familiar stop and the arrow has a long stun on KSI and God brought him down before he can get that wall off. But then God, Laguna bladed up. He lit up his Moonlight Shadow, going to give LG International the cover of Moonlight to fight this battle out. Darcy had brought back, backs him back into the wall now. And 1437 just backing up with a sole assumption. Oh, it's 
a matter of how you play. Tier one tower, oh, wow. back wall, beautiful pike at last strike array, and Laguna Blade ball from our side. They get the kill on the Razor very, very quickly. LGD International, they're forced to use their fortification. Puck also looking to see if he wants to jump in or not. And now with a Naga ulti. That's going to be a four-man Dream Coil. Yeah, and then Orb in and then Silence. Dream Coil only caught two. A little bit of time to rage in this. Soul Assumption just got thrown to crazy, but the back, back into a three-man line struck away by Arsar. Leap away from Sergei. God gets them space. The Orb, LG International, they got themselves in a horrid position. But now, um, they basically leaped out, spaced up a little bit more. God, don't die. Miss the arrow. Has the agency more trigger, and that is all. Razor kills off Ilda in the middle lane, but they're looking to pick up KSI. The funny thing is, the man who caused him all the trouble, he's back at base right now. Took me to back, only got to creep up there. But Asa, that was a really great light strike array. That was amazing, yes. With the vacuum and into uh, Lina Stan, it's really a nice combination. KSI is going to no, no way TP, out of this. So, can even just arrow for vision. They see where he is and they're going to just... He doesn't have a back to clean up the tree line either. Pops the mech, goes down. It's the back spot and oh. the entire God. of LG International is following him. The oh. tornado got thrown in oh, yeah. a unusual position. NS already with a heal and then Brax in with a silence. The old damage nowhere near enough. He just basically jaws himself away and now NS still on the run. Misery comes in close but now Illidan well, he's already used a rage, he's, and you can see Misery, he almost wants to make sure he holds the second inch there until Illidan, nah, he just throws it anyway. Illidan doesn't rage and TP out. In fact, Misery throws the ulti out just to make sure NS stays with him. back. Yeah, the TP into the top lane, they want to fight this one, but they're going to lose NS before that happens. Like, Flads of Field, they're using Miranda Altman, there's one bit of dust thrown off so they can at least see all of LG International. Over on the side, DK. He's in close on 1437. And Illidan, he's the other one to worry about. Arrow flies down. And who's he gonna hit on? Hits on our DK. Holding him in position. That does see a wall again causing issues and misery. Lacuna bladed down to death, but Elgin International, they're not giving this one up. There's your crit from God. Able to pick off the Darkseer and moving deeper down to Illidan. The bottom top. Gonna go for that kill. Oh, okay. see the reason why not. Blink and a hex. Hold him in position and then just deal off a little bit of his damage. And silence him. And now crazy. Hexed up, instead. Puck all familiar stomp, DK's down. This is almost a possibility to break the base now. Almost, yeah. They can probably just go in and right kick him, so gonna try. They go high ground. And the tier 3 tower will be the main focus. Remember to, more misery. Asa, arrow. arrow's flying uh, in, and it actually hit, wow. he walked back into it. Yeah, I thought he juked that one, but had to run back. So, mm. hit. And back, wall, two copies, already with the leap away. Flyback comes out from the DK. VP aren't letting this go without a fight. They got two familiars, they throw out the dust, hoping to be in range. They get Brax, but Misery, in Snare, as well as the Hex, a three-man Dream Coil. The Pox aren't swell, Crazy Dylan, worst place to be. This will now be a Rax, with almost a flawless fight. And it's GG, in fact, coming out from Virtus Pro. Yeah, LGD too strong. Just really nice performance by a team fight.